Hello Star Wars fans, it's me, Django Fett Fan 9563 here with something new. It is the Star Wars Black Series Chewbacca Target exclusive. I got this from Target today. It has no number. You could pause, pause this if you want to read it if you want to so here's the packaging so has this hanger that we could use as a collector's item so I'm gonna unbox it for you guys okay okay here's Chewbacca I wish him from his plastic prison. I'm gonna cut those elastic bands right there. And here's plaster rifle. And his and his goggles, kind of stretchy though. Okay, so here's Chewbacca, looks really cool. So we're gonna go to the articulation first. He has this. Let's see. Um, ball. Rocker jointed ball hinged ankles, ball hinged knees, not double hinged knees. Okay. Ball hinged hips. They swivel pretty tight because it's new. Because I recently got it. This one does not move. Only this one does. This one does not want to move. It's probably just my figure. So, so. Here. So, ball hinge wrists, they both go in and out. This one does not go up and down. And ball hinge elbows, ball hinge shoulders, and a ball joint neck. Well, moves just a little bit because cannot really move the head at all the way. Cannot rotate it at 360. Can just move it a little bit anyway because the fur right there. So I'm gonna put on. I'm gonna put on. Put his blaster in his hand. Ugh. It's pretty hard to put it in because it's new and I recently got it, like I said. So I'm trying to hang on. Okay, there we go, and he's ready to shoot. Right there. And, and I'm gonna put on his goggles, and he's ready for action. This is the solo movie version, by the way. If you don't know this version yet, 
so no spoilers for the solo movie. So there you go. There's Chewbacca. Good detailing on him. So good detailing. Look at all that detailing on his fur and the bandolier. And a rubbery. So I think that's pretty much it. And by the way, he's a bit taller than the rest of my figures. The, my other Black Series figures. So, talk to you later. Bye.